All right, a Case Western medical student is breaking barriers and making history. She just accomplished something that no one has done before. Our common Blackwell has more on her incredible story tonight. That's right, Matt. 26 year old Tamaya Potter just crossed the stage on Saturday at Case Western as a med school graduate. And back in April, she opened her envelope at Match Day, the day medical students nationwide learn what residency programs they've been accepted to. That's when Tamaya learned she'd be heading off to her next chapter, but while also making history as the very first black woman to join the neurosurgical program at Vanderbilt University. We read about history. When you think about the average neurosurgeon, you don't think about me. But it's not often we become part of it. For Case Western Med School graduate Tamaya Potter, her dream of becoming a neurosurgeon is one step closer to becoming reality. Her story now making history. Tamaya has been accepted to Vanderbilt University next semester, making her the first black female neurosurgeon resident in the school's nearly 150 year history. According to the National Institute of Health, there are only 33 black female neurosurgeons in the nation. And now Tamaya will mark one more. Sometimes I don't realize who I am and what I look like when I'm doing this. So to me, I'm just doing my job. But to everybody else, they see a black woman doing a really great job. This achievement, personal for Tamaya. She's the first in her family to go to medical school. And while family has been her biggest support system, she's been encouraged and inspired by a special mentor. I realized it was possible it's because I saw Dr. Tiffany Hodges. You know, she's a black neurosurgeon at um, UH here, at University Hospitals, and she was the first one I've ever seen. Tamaya believes the reason few minorities pursue medicine is because of a lack of guidance, knowledge, and support. But I'm just happy that I'm visible and other black girls can see me. But being granted the chance to pave the way for black and brown women with hopes of pursuing the same dream is an honor and will be another Tamaya, and I will have the experience to help them. And I can't get that if someone gives everything to me. You know, I have to learn for myself what it means to go through this path that way that I can educate and give back to others. One she plans to carry with her to Vanderbilt. Well, Tamaya is thrilled to start her first year at Vanderbilt on July 1st. She told me that she's always been very interested in the spine. So a very special congratulations to you, Tamaya, from all of us right here at 3 News. Matt? Yeah, what an amazing story. Thanks, Carmen. And uh, we'll, of course, wish her luck in that journey. Absolutely. Thank you.